As we all become more eco-conscious, you might decide that composting is a good idea. And it is. However, if you have dogs, you'll need to take caution when disposing of old or mouldy food. Mould produces tremogenic mycotoxins, which can cause severe side effects. Eating even a small amount can cause serious health problems. In compost, there are at least 19 known moulds that can be dangerous to dogs. If you want to know what other foods to avoid, check out our free handout. It's not just compost that's an issue. Several types of nut, like walnuts, are also hazardous. Other mouldy food includes dairy products, mouldy grains and pasta. Therefore, even if you haven't got a compost pile, you do need to be careful when disposing of food waste. With quick treatment, most dogs will recover. However, because these toxins can be life-threatening, so even if no visible symptoms develop, getting your vet's opinion is worthwhile. It's better to be safe than sorry. If your dog has eaten something dodgy, they'll most likely experience abdominal pain, vomiting, diarrhea, and other gastrointestinal problems. They may lose control of their movement and have seizures. In extreme cases of poisoning, these symptoms can lead to death. If you suspect they've eaten something mouldy, watch your dog for any negative signs. If symptoms start to develop, seek medical attention immediately. Your dog might begin vomiting to try and remove as much of the toxins as possible. When you're at the vet, they'll do a physical examination, a biochemistry profile and a complete blood count. If your dog is vomiting profusely or has diarrhoea, they might use some of it to work out what toxin is poisoning your dog. Your vet may induce vomiting or pump the stomach to remove any of the mouldy food and give them activated charcoal afterwards to stop them from absorbing any remaining toxins. If your dog is dehydrated, your vet will likely provide IV fluids, which will also flush the toxins out quicker. If your dog has tremors or seizures, they might administer muscle relaxants and anti-seizure drugs. The key to treating mycotoxin poisoning is prevention. Since there is no cure, action needs to be taken straight away to avoid further problems or pain. To request a copy of our handout, email handouts at puppyclassroom.com and to inquire about our range of dog foods, email team at designerdogfoods.co.uk.